They got to be sure that he doesn't do like he did at Bristol. Remember when they had to tell him to slow down? He was overdriving the corners. He needs to slow down. He's overdriving these corners. Boy, Dave Blaney in that 22 car just drove it down into three, and he's going to lose all kind of oh, positions. Oh, Lord. Ward wow, Bradley Ricky got Rudd. sideways. Tony Stewart gets damaged. Caution is out. Ward Burton in the four was trying to stay the first car one lap down. And he got hard into Ricky Rudd. Yeah, he just gassed it up at not at a good time. And it all started getting into turn three when Blaney got in there, washed up the racetrack with the front tires just sliding and smoking. These cars just don't like to be close to each other. And Martin Truex had a great run going. He stalled Top out. 10, and he stopped. He's got serious damage with fluids running out. Yep. A couple of Virginia gentlemen pile it up here in turn three. Watch the four of Ward Burton. It all happens surrounding him as he trails Blaney. Blaney locks the brakes up, getting into three. That slows his momentum down. Here comes Ward, and he's just trying to go three wide, and it's not enough room. Ooh. Turns Ricky Rudd. Boy, Blaney was lucky. And Tony you know, gets a little piece of it. Daryl, I'm not sure I can pin that on Ward. I believe Sterling Marlin might have gotten the back of Burton did he, and did turned him around. Him? Did he bump him? I think so. Uh, Marlin's in the 14. Oh, yeah, you're right. He pushed the left rear around on the four car, turned the left front down into Ricky Rudd, the 88. Did you see that little clip that Blaney got right on the left rear corner of the Ooh. bumper, man? And there's Tony. He gets a piece of it. Yeah, we'll see here. 14 gets just a little bit into the four, gets him loose, and when he corrects it, goes right into... Uh, and then, the 88. And then Marlin almost got turned around by Kurt Busch, and Tony Stewart could not avoid Burton. And here's Blaney. I see he did spin. He's yeah. coming down through here. He just got clipped. And Montoya got turned around, and you see Truex as well. Now they're pushing Truex's car out of the grass. This it, well, it's trying to refire. But... Wow, you're in the middle. Rutt took a hard shot in the Boy, wall. Boy, he did. There. I mean, he just had no idea that was coming. Now, here's Truex in the one trying to check up. A.J. Allmendinger, I saw him with damage on pit road. That's who got in the back, the left rear of Truex Jr. in the one car. I told you. The Truex's car was in gear going backwards. All that unburnt fuel piled up, and that's why they couldn't get him restarted. Now they have, as Ricky Rudd, former winner and veteran of this track back to when it was a half mile, walks away. Won a race here with his eyes taped open. Yes, from 1984. a crash, yeah, yep. at Daytona the week before. Dick Bergman? Well, Alan Gustafson's car with Kyle Busch at the wheel has gone from 34th starting position all the way to first. But today, your driver has been playing offense until now. Now he has to play defense and with a teammate behind him. How does he do that? Um, it's uh, anytime you got Jimmy Johnson behind him, it's going to be tough. But I'm just real proud of all these guys on this Kellogg's Car Quest Chevrolet. They've done a really good job. We struggled yesterday, and nobody nobody got down. Everybody kept their heads up, kept digging, uh, got this car uh, running well now today. Kyle's done a well of a job. I move on, Jimmy. That's all Kyle Bush right there. So uh, we're going to do all we can. It's nice to have teammates behind you and uh, see if we can't get a one, two, three for Mr. H. Why is he so good on restarts today? Uh, a lot of it's Kyle, you know, gearing that Hendrick horsepower doesn't hurt. So uh, total combination, it's a total team effort top to bottom. And, and, and Kyle's really good here at Richmond. He's always been good here at Richmond. His record shows it. So uh, we like to get that thing in victory lane. Yeah, the pit crew has been sharp today too, Mike Joy. Yes.